Keep your head up, family. Every day our redemption draweth closer and closer. And the verse of the day is, For Christ is the end of the law for righteousness to everyone that believeth. Praise you, Jesus Christ. Romans 10.4 all right, if you missed the title of the video, it's 717. The 9th of Av was 717, July 17th. Both times the temple was destroyed in history. On the Torah calendar, the first temple was destroyed on the 9th of Av in 423 BCE. It was on July 17th. And when the second temple was destroyed on the 9th of Av in 69 CE on the Torah calendar, it was on July 17th too. 717 both times. So the chances of sudden destruction and the rapture happening on the 9th of Av seem very good, family. But remember, we can't limit God. The rapture can happen any day, any hour. The rapture can be before or after the 9th of Av on 8-11 this year. Or it could be on the 9th of Av, Tisha B'Av on 8-11. Remember, Jesus Christ said, If therefore thou shalt not watch, I will come on thee as a thief, and thou shalt not know what hour I will come upon thee. So the rapture can happen any day, any hour. And it could be on the anniversary of the destruction of the temple that happened twice on the 9th of Av. And we are only days away from the anniversary of that. It's on 8-11, August 11th. And we shared this information a few times. My wife Christina had a dream about five years ago that 725 was there, but no one could find 811. And everyone was panicking trying to find 811, but no one could find it. And we shared this in previous videos, fam. And we've also shared that 1,335 days from 8-11-2019 lands on Passover, April 7, 2023. And the Jewish people don't believe in our Jesus Christ Passover. And what's gigantinormous is that our Passover, April 7, 2023, is the third day of their Passover, the Old Testament Jewish Passover that they do believe in. The Jewish Passover week is April 5th through April 12th, 2023. So 8-11, August 11th, this year, could be the rapture. Or the rapture could be today, or any day. Jesus Christ said right before he ascended to heaven, It's not for you to know the times or seasons which my Father hath put in his own power. And we give all glory to our Father. And we praise Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. And we follow him. And what he said. And our father could give us a 40 day warning. And he might have. And it could have been on July 2nd. When the total solar eclipse took place. Because if you add 40 days to July 2nd's total eclipse of the sun. The day the sun turned dark. It lands on 8-11-2019. And again we are only days away from 8-11. Praise you Jesus Christ. And this could be the rapture. And it could be right now. But it might not be. Let's keep it real. Many of our brothers and sisters thought we would already be with Jesus Christ. And most of our family in Jesus thought the rapture would be September 23rd, 2017, the Revelation 12 sign. And many thought May 14th this year, 2019. And there was a huge rapture buzz about 717, 2019. This month, July 17th. But it passed too. So there's been many rapture dates set by many, and they all passed. So we're watching every hour, and we're expecting Jesus Christ every day. And we're here for you, family, and we're here to announce the signs in the sun and the moon and the stars and to report what's coming, facts and history too. And it's a fact that the 9th of Av is on 8-11 this year, 2019. And it's a fact that it's also on 717, July 17th, 2021, in America, on our calendar. And the Heb Cow, too. And again, Jesus Christ said, It's not for us to know the times or seasons our Father hath put in his own power. So the rapture can happen any day that our Father has appointed, praise you, Jesus Christ. For every day you give us to labor and bring in the great harvest until the rapture happens. So again, we don't know when the rapture is. The Holy Spirit told me what's most important is what we do until the rapture happens. And it can happen any day. 
And remember, this is Gigantinormous 2. September 17th this year on the Torah calendar is 717, the third day of the Feast of Tabernacles. And it's also the Israeli elections and so much more. And if we're still here and we get closer to that date, I'll go over all that information with you, family. Today, though, is the first black supermoon of this trilogy. So we're waiting for this new moon to be confirmed in Israel. And we're watching every hour, expecting Jesus Christ every day. But the next gigantinormous watch date, especially for us, if we're still here, is 8-11. This year, August 11th, Tisha B'Av, the 9th of Av, the anniversary of when the temple was destroyed twice. So keep your head up, family. And keep shining brightly. And if you need invitations, all you have to do is email us and we'll ship you 200 invitations to the Great Wedding Feast. All the information is in the description box under this video. And make sure you catch our next video, if we're still here. I think everyone is going to be stunned when they see the 811 title and info. Love you, fam. All glory to our Father. Praise Jesus Christ for everything He's shown us and for all the fruit He has produced through us and through you. With us, family, in Jesus Christ. So keep doing what Jesus Christ said and show love, mercy, and forgiveness to all. Follow the two greatest commandments. All the laws and all the prophets hang on those two great commandments. And I'm feeling the Holy Spirit praise you, Jesus Christ. And remember what Jesus said in Revelation 3.3. 3, remember, therefore, how thou hast received and heard and hold fast and repent. If therefore thou shalt not watch, I will come on thee as a thief, and thou shalt not know what hour I will come upon thee.